Hello everyone, my name is Stephanie Levine. I'm a senior project manager with the Public Works Agency and we're just under two months from the News Crown Center opening its ICE operation. We're looking here at the main rink, rink one, which is nearing completion. It's got about a thousand seats in uh, the bleacher area and this is a NHL sized ice rink. Okay, so now we're up on the second floor and we're looking down on rink one and we're actually standing on the uh, track that runs around this rink and this will be available for use by the public for running, walking, and just general exercise. So looking the other direction, um, again, back up on this uh, second floor level, uh, the corridor that we see down the hall here is gonna include uh, the administrative offices for the recreation department. It's gonna include um, a multi-purpose room and uh, also has some restrooms up here as well. We're now upstairs in looking at the gymnasium space. Um, this is just starting to get uh, completed now. Um, you can see the basketball standards have been installed. Uh, the floor we're standing on here is an acoustical slab and it's actually going to get lifted so that it's uh, separated from the library below and then a wood floor will be installed above it. So right now we're on the second floor lobby space and we're looking down at the library which is one of the last areas that's going to be completed for the project. Uh, the library is going to include uh, an open collection, a children's area, um, some meeting rooms, uh, almost like a classroom space. It's also expandable so that it can bleed into uh, the lobby space. Okay, so once again, we're on the second floor. Now we're in a separate wing that um, has changing rooms. Um, this multi-purpose space, which is behind me, kind of a, a fitness space. And then there's also an art room down the hall as well. What's interesting about this room is that you actually get a view into the second ice rink directly from this space. So now we're on the first floor and we're looking down the changing room corridor. This corridor separates the two ice rinks and it includes nine changing rooms and also a lace-up room for the general skate. So we're now in the first floor in the preschool wing. We've got four classrooms in this space. This is a dedicated wing just for preschool operations. Okay, everyone, that's our November Robert Crown Project update. Thanks for watching.